Bob, I want to dive straight in to your journey and to really dive into your work that you're doing today. And I think I was really blown away to hear about your time as a Marine. And, and I'd like to start there. Well, you know, when I enlisted in the Marine Corps, I did so mostly because I had two friends of mine ask me to join them. They were, we were in our senior year of high school and they were going to visit with the Marine Corps recruiter and asked me if I'd go along with them. And I did, you know, as we spent time with the Marine Corps recruiter, he eventually had us in the palm of his hands. I mean, this was during the, the, the height of the Vietnam War in 1968. I lasted one month and uh, walking through a uh, village at night, I was on the point team and uh, the point man, uh, he, uh, uh, stepped over a tripwire, missed it, and I hit it, and that thing blew, and I got uh, shrapnel on both my legs and my left elbow, and I was met medevaced out. I left on a stretcher. So, uh, you know, the, the thoughts that, that I took back from that is uh, I think I learned to think one day at a time, and I looked to quantify the worst thing that could possibly happen. That's got me through a number of businesses. I've, I've built three businesses now, and I'm working on the third all from scratch. And, uh, you know, when you do a startup, a startup, you have a lot of good days and a lot of bad days. And uh, sometimes, you know, the good days are euphoric and the bad days look like uh, Armageddon. Mm -hmm. uh, so, you know, how you think really matters. And I learned during the war how to think. I learned to quantify the worst thing, and quite often the worst thing, when you sit down and you quantify, it's not so bad. But if you, you know, if you look at the worst thing, it's this big, dark room full of uh, bad things that could happen. Then it looks like far worse than it actually is, and and then it becomes debilitating. Yeah, I mean that's such a powerful reflection. Hearing that from you, based on the experiences that you went through. Often we hear that idea, but sitting with you here today, listening to in person, I can feel just how, how real that idea is for you. 